is I want you to all right I'd like for everybody to just read what it says up the top it says work sorry Vicky Vicky sorry you are Vicky where are you can you see you on mute Vicky yeah we we can't hear you sorry I Oh. I muted everyone and then I muted you. Sorry. <laughs> okay. All right. all right. Never mind. I'll start again. So everybody needs this photocopy. Good. Now, this is about art elements. We're going to look at art elements. I want everybody to think about art elements as the ingredients in a cake. When you make a cake, what are some of the things you put inside the cake? Who can tell me? Who can tell me what goes inside the cake? I want you to unmute yourself and I want you to put your hand up, answer that question. What are some of the things that you put inside a cake? Do you put eggs? Yes, Mia? Unmute yourself. You put eggs and flour. Yes. Anything else? Do you put sugar? Yes, and milk. Yeah. Do you put markers and pencils in a cake? Of course not. No, of course not. Do you put glasses? No. No. So... I want everybody to think about the art elements as the things that we put into a painting or a drawing, okay? And we're going to have a look around the room to see what kinds of things we can find in our environment that are on this list. Let's quickly go through the list. The first one says, what does the first one say? What does that say? Who can read that for me? Line. Yes. It line. says line. Yeah. So line, I want everybody to look around their room and see if they can find lines everywhere. I'm going to, I'm going to point out a few lines in my place, okay? Look at this. Is this a line? Yeah. Yes. Is this a line? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay? And Peter. Everywhere there is a line. This is a line. Everybody look around their room and see if you can see lines everywhere. I can see lines everywhere. Lines. Lines, lines, lines everywhere. Okay. Now, I want everybody to take a marker or a texture and I want you to draw a line. Like this. Can everybody see what I've drawn here? Lines. I, I want you to draw a wavy line, a straight line, and a zigzag line. Okay. Okay. Can you do that? Yes. Okay, everybody do that now. Wavy line, wavy line, straight line and zigzag line. Okay, we're going to look at lines a little bit later. Okay, but for now, we'll have a look at all the elements. The next one says, what does the next one say? Can anybody read what the next one says? Okay. Colour. I want you to take some colours 
Doesn't matter what they are, and I want you to just draw oh, yeah. some lines. Draw some some uh, draw some colors on that in that space. Doesn't matter what color they are. You go and get your day. Just do some scribbles where it's lying. Is it where it says color? Dorothy, should I put this line on? Should I put that light on? No, I think uh, no. it's okay. Yeah. I think so. I spoke and I bought that. Yes. Yeah. Or if you want me to remove, you want to. You want to do board, board screen or just the laptop one? Board, yeah? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I, I, can, yeah. Keep, I can keep that one there. We're, we're going to mm -hmm. use that later. All right, now, yeah. next one. What does the next one say, everybody? What does the next one say? Read for me. Value. 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 Very good. Now, value normally means how expensive something is, yeah? But that's not the kind of value we're talking about when we're talking about art. Value means the light or the dark something. So this is what I want you to do, okay? I want you to, in that space where it says value, I want everybody to draw in pencil. I want you to draw five boxes. Five boxes in a row. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. I'm going to do it in a little bit. I'm going to do it with a texter, but you can do it in a pencil so that you can see what I'm doing. Okay. Just so that you can see what I'm doing, I want you to draw five squares like this where it says value. Can everybody see that? Can you do that now? Now, what I want you to do is I want you to grab your pencil and I want you to draw. I want you to colour in the first square very, very dark, okay, as dark as you can without breaking the pencil, okay? Really, really dark, okay? This is going to be our darkest value. Do you remember what I said what value means? It means the light or the dark of something. So please take your pencil and draw. The first one has to be very, very dark. Now, when I'm finished my first square, the very dark one, I'm going to move over to the other square and I'm going to make it just a little bit lighter, okay? Just a little bit lighter. Still going to be dark, not as dark, okay? This is what you're going to create. Can everybody see this? This is what we call a value scale. Value. Can everybody say value? Value. Value. Good. Value. That's right. We are going to talk about value later, but not today. We're just going to introduce all the elements Okay, that's a little bit lighter. Can everybody see that my next shade is just a little bit lighter than the first one? Yeah, good. I want to see your work. Hold up your work so I can see good Mia. Very good. Now, we're going to go to the next one. The next one is going to be lighter or darker? What's the next one going to be? Lighter. Good. So now we have to press less. Okay, we're not going to press as hard as what we did before. 
and there has to be a difference in the shade. This is what we call value. Value is the light or dark of a bitch. What the? Okay, there you go. Can you see the difference? Yeah. All right, and let's continue to the next one until we go to the last one where it's going to be really, really light, okay? This is what we call a value scale, from really dark to really light. And there's my value, my five-grade value scale. This is what I want you to do. Okay, when you're finished, I want you to hold up your work and I want to see what you've done. Very good, Mia. Come on, guys, I want to see your work, please. Hold up your work. I can't. You, now, um, good day. you good put on this gallery, you would be able to see everyone, Vicky. Yeah, I put on gallery. Now, Suti has got a background in hers and I can't see her work at all. Suti, uh, Suti can you turn off the background? You replace your background. Everyone, yeah. Good, Mina. Very nice, Mina. Jack and Li 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 Lily. Very yeah. nice. Very okay. good. Very good. Suti, mẹ, mẹ hiểu không? Mẹ bỏ cái background nha. Perfect for Elsa. James, uh, James and Trần Ngọc, you can you remove your blurring background? Make yeah, your James. make it non. Yeah. So remove uh, blur my background like like Hien like Miss Yeah. Ni Nien, Hien and Nien, did you finish your work? Can I have a look at your work? Good tea, Tien. Tien, that's beautiful. Book, yes. Book now, I think, I think your second last one can be a little bit lighter. Okay, book. Your second last one can be a little bit lighter. Jay, Lily, Lily, good. Okay. So let's move to the next one. What does it say? Can anybody read the next one here on this list? We have shape. Okay, we're going to do shapes. Now, unmute yourself and I want you to tell me what kinds of shapes you know. What shapes do you know? Tell me, Elsa. Unmute yourselves. Everybody unmute yourselves. Elsa, tell me a shape. Um, Dorothy, everyone's saying that they can't unmute. Yeah, yeah, because I block it. So, um, yeah. can can I talk to the? Can because, you unmute uh, everybody? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do. Can can I yes. talk them in Vietnamese? Yeah, for one yes. minute. Yes. Um, các bạn ơi, hồi nãy có mấy bạn để mic ồn quá, thành ra là cô Đức phải khóa hết. Bây giờ cô Đức đề nghị là các bạn. Tụi con cố gắng ha, khi nào mình không nói thì mình tắt, thì cô sẽ giữ. À, rồi mẹ Mai Anh ơi, Mai Anh, à, em à, em có biết cái, cái chức năng để mở host với cầu host không? À, xin lỗi, em có biết chức năng mở mic với tắt mic cho các bạn không? Trên cái nút security á, thì, thì khi nào em thấy bạn ồn á, thì em tắt mic bạn đó. Uh, em có quen không? Uh, ask to unmute đúng không cô? thì mình 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 sẽ đúng rồi mình, hoặc là em cậu... em không trên cái security á thì em em bỏ cái <cười> em bỏ cái option em click vô là unmute đâm sao là em cho các bạn nói Còn em bỏ ra là nha yeah. nhé yeah. ok trên cái security I I just um, get you as assistant because I'm not be able to stay the whole night tonight so I just yeah. want someone to help yeah Yeah, yeah. hoặc là mẹ nào mẹ Huyền Nguyễn nè hay mẹ nào quen về làm zoom làm trợ lý cho cô 
mình thêm một vài mẹ cũng được có được mà không con con nhỏ quá con có biết làm không dạ yeah. không biết ạ dạ yeah. mẹ hồng nhung hả à bạn nào mà biết làm hố sử dụng à, thường quen em, thì giúp cô biết cái việc đó em thấy rồi cô à, rồi em thấy ha rồi rồi ok rồi bây giờ các bạn tạm thời khóa nha rồi right, Vicky then so yeah. the co-host will be your assistant ok yeah. yeah where is she um ok em em đổi tên is my an so I put mom and my an yeah so where you see the letter mom that is the one rồi bạn nào nữa Hồng Nhung hả? Em có ngồi em có ngồi đây thường không? Mẹ có ngồi đây thường không? Ờ uh, mom, yep yep. Yeah, so so mom and Hồng Nhung right? So yeah, I think I get you too. Right. Okay, yeah. So two of them will be right. Okay, thank you Vicky. Uh now go thank one you. more thing. Can we can we end the class a sharp on time because I have another class tonight? And I can't, I need the Zoom. I can't run to <laughs> at the same time, yeah? Okay, yep. yeah. All yep. right, thank yep. you, Vicky. Yep. I'll, yeah. I'll do, yes. Okay. Now, Dorothy, when I'm asking questions, I like some of my students to answer. So we have to unmute them when I ask the question. I leave okay. them on unmute now. Yeah, I leave them on unmute. Yeah. So and when tell the, them not to I make noise them. while other people are answering. If everybody's unmuted, They can't make noise while somebody's talking. Sure, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, okay. Thì các con này cố gắng là mình tắt mic ha. Khi nào mà được cô giáo hỏi thì lúc đó mình có thể giơ tay rồi mình mình bật mic ra. Một bạn nói thôi và tất cả các bạn phải cần lại lắng nghe ha. All right, yeah. Okay. You can ask them to type the answer in the chat too. Yeah. Say again. Say again. I didn't hear you. If if you want all the student to to answer at the same time, they can write the answer in the chat box. Right. Okay. Good. Yeah. Okay. All right. So everybody, we are looking at shapes now. Remember, what are we doing? We are looking at the art elements, and the art elements are what makes up a painting, okay, or a drawing. It's like all the ingredients in cake, okay like the eggs and the flour and the sugar this is these are the things these are the things that are in shapes all right this is why we are looking at these these are the things inside an art picker right now let's have a look at shape i want everybody to type in what shapes they know everybody type in in the chat what kinds of shapes can you name Okay. What's this one? What is this one? Who knows? Is that a square? Is that a triangle? No. It's a circle. Good. Okay, so we have a circle. Everybody draw. Everybody have a look at the chat and look at what everybody has written. And I want you to draw these things in your on your page where it says shape, okay? So here where it says shape. I want you, sorry, that was value. Where it says shape, I want everybody to draw. Okay, I'm going to draw a circle, a triangle. Yes, a square. There's a hexagram, there's um, a crescent, a crescent, there's a rectangle and a square. Okay, everybody have a look at all the different shapes that I've made here. Oh, what about an oval? Yeah, what about an oval? There you go. Okay, let's move over to the next one. Who can read for me what it says up top because I've got a different list. 
I think the, the form. next one says form. That's right. It says form. I've got a different list for you here. All right, form, and then it says space and form and texture. All right, form is when we take a shape and we make it three-dimensional, okay? Three-dimensional means a real-life one. I'm going to show you here how to make a shape, a square, turn into a form. Can everybody see what I've done there? Who can do that? Who can make a square look like a cube? Can you do that? I'm going to do it again. I'm going to do it simply. Okay, so what form means is a real life. This, this glue stick, that's form. Everything is form. This pen is form. Everything is form. What is not form is a picture. Okay? It looks like form, but it's not. This is flat. It's not a real person, that's not form, right? Anything that is real, this is a form. It has shape, it has dimensions, okay? It has width and height. All right, so everybody, another way you can depict form is by drawing a round circle, right? Drawing a round circle and drawing some value on that circle. So drawing value to show that this circle has become now a sphere. This is how, this is how we turn a, a, a one-dimensional object into a three, looks like three-dimensional, okay? So this is how we create it. We do shading, okay? Now this circle, Suddenly, it looks like a sphere. Can you see how this circle has now taken the shape of a sphere? Because I've created some shades, some value, I've added value. So now we have the illusion of form. It's not a real form. You know that this is not a real ball, okay? That's not a real ball, but it looks like one, okay? It looks like a ball. This. this is what we call form, okay? This is what, what we, when we say form, this is what we mean. Very good. Tien, fantastic sushi. Very nice. Oh, that's amazing. Aren't you good? You did the pyramid as well. That's gorgeous. Okay, let's move to the next one, space. Now, I want everybody to think about when we have something that's close to us, is it big or is it small? Everybody hold your hand like this in front of your face. Hold your hand like this in front of your face. Does your hand look big? Does your hand look big? Yes. Does it look big? Yeah. Now hold your hand back. Is it smaller? Yes. It's much smaller, isn't it? Okay. Your hand is big when it's close to your face and it's big when it's away from your face. Okay. Now, I want everybody here where it says space, I want you to draw a big tree all the way to the line up top. Can everybody see that? I'll do it in text so you can see it. Okay, that is one, one tree all the way to the top. Okay, a big tree from the bottom to the top. Okay. Now, I want you all to draw 
middle sized tree somewhere in the middle here. Okay, watch me as I do this. I'm going to put a middle sized tree. One, two, three, four. Okay, four middle sized trees. But they have to be in the middle of the picture. Is everybody drawing their trees? Yes. And now I want you to draw the horizon line. Now watch me as I do this. I'm going to draw a line across the trees, not through the trees, across the trees. And this is going to be my horizon line. Okay, is, can everybody see what I'm looking at? Okay, now I want you to draw very, very tiny trees on the horizon line, on the horizon line, but they have to be really, really tiny in the background. So what we're trying to achieve is we are trying to, we are trying to depict Space, something that is close to us, like this big tree, a big, something that is in the middle ground is a little bit smaller, but something in the background is very, very small. It's tiny. Okay, I'm going to hold that up again so you can see what I've done. This is how we create space. Does everybody understand what space is? Okay, space. Okay, I want everybody to hold up pictures, please. I want to see your pictures. Yay! Wait, Tien, Sushi, you have to, ah, oh, yes, you've got one small, you've only got one small house uh, um, tree in the background. You've only got one. Do some more little ones, okay, Sushi? Tien, Tien, do some more. Very nice, Mum and Mai. Very nice. Oh, good, Jack and Lai, Lily. Mina, let me see yours. Mina, where did she go? My sister's, my sister's name is Lily. Now, Elsa, I feel as though your middle size, your middle size trees are a little bit small. Okay, I want your middle size trees to be a little bit bigger. Okay, all right, Elsa, make them a little bit bigger. Let me see you, Suti. Suti, show me your work, please. Very nice book. Yes. Now, book, look at where my middle-sized trees are. They're in the middle. They're not at the bottom here. Yours are down the bottom. I don't want your trees to be down the bottom. I want them to be in the middle. Okay. Okay, now the last one is texture. Does anybody know what texture is? Do you know what texture is? Texture is how something feels. Everybody touch your skin here on your, on your cheeks. Touch your skin. What does that feel like? What does it feel like? Soft? Yes? Now I want you to touch your clothes. What does that feel like? That's your, your clothes, yeah? Now I want you to touch your um, nails, your nails. Now I want you to touch underneath your shoes, under your shoes. Are you wearing shoes? What does that feel like? Is it rough? Yeah? Now. What I want you to do is I want you to find something that has texture on it. Now, what can I find? Wait, I'll just go and get something that has texture. This is my water bottle. See this? 
I'm going to put my water bottle here and I'm going to take my pencil and I'm going to, oh no, that's, that's not going to work. Wait, let me get something else. Everybody see this tray? Okay, this tray feels very rough here. Yeah? I don't know what material it is, but watch what happens. Yeah. Watch what happens when I put my paper on top like this, right? And watch what happens when I rub it. Can everybody see what's happened there? That's texture, okay? Who can find something in the house that has texture? I want you to try your shoes. Have a look under your shoe. Usually there's a nice pattern under your shoe. I want you to take your piece of paper and put, your, put it on your shoe. And then I want you to start rubbing. This is what we call the rubbing technique. Can you do that now? I want to see all those different. Have you got have you got a shave? Elsa? Have you got something under your shoe, Elsa? I don't like that. I don't like it. This in my paper. You don't want to put it on your paper? That's okay. You can find something else in your house. What else have you got? What can we use? Uh, can I don't we have use that. It? Yes, yes, you can use that for sure. Oh. What's that, Mia? What did you use? I use a pencil case. Yeah, the pencil case. That's excellent. That's an excellent idea. You know what I asked if I can use my watch? I can use my watch. See my watch, right? I'm going to put my watch here under my paper and then I'm going to rub it. And that's what I'm going to do with texture. I can't find anything like that in my house. Can't you? Are you sure? If you look, you might find something, a pot, maybe a pot plant or um, a tile in your, in your house. Okay, so now we have, now we have all of this. We have all of our. I got this. The shoe. No, so I got this. Wait a minute, who's talking to me? And I just. Uh... Mum and Mai, very good, very good, Mum and Mai. Let me see, let me see all your texture. I want to see all the, the texture that you, you made with the rubbing technique, okay, the rubbing technique. Maybe your chair. Actually, book, what about your chair? Do you want to do your chair? The chair that you're sitting on. All right, now. These are. I'm not using this. What are you using? Oh, that's amazing, Elsa. What did you use, Elsa? Did you use your shoe? Yes, I used my shoe and the catalog. Excellent. Everybody, have a look at Elsa's picture. Let me see, Elsa. It's excellent. Good girl. Have... That's amazing. Let me see, book. Yeah. Yeah, very good. All right. Now, these are what we call the elements of art. We're going to go through each of those separately, okay, for the lessons that are coming. We need to understand these art elements, okay? All these are elements. All right. Now, 
I want everybody to take a piece of paper. Um, A3 or A4? A3, please. Thanks. A3. I want everybody to fold this in threes, okay? In three. Three. One, two, three. Can everybody see what I've done here? One, two, three. Okay? Or draw a line. I folded mine. And then I'm going to draw a line across here like this. One. And then another one there, okay? I want three separate parts. We divide in three yeah, parts. Yeah, not that way, the other way. Three parts. Oh, yes, no, you're fine, Tien, you're fine. Okay, are we ready? Now, I want everybody in this first part here, I want everybody to imagine a hammer. Okay, don't look at a picture, just imagine what a hammer looks like. Okay, think about it in your head. I think a hammer looks like this. This is what I think a hammer looks like. Okay, that's what I do. Show me your pictures. I want to see what you are going to draw in your imagination. We're not looking at any pictures. Just with your imagination, I want you to draw a hammer. Do you know what a hammer is? You know, when we're making something, yeah, and we're hitting a nail with a hammer. I don't know, I don't know about. Sorry, who said that? Me. Mina, do you know what a hammer is? Yes. Yeah, I want you to uh, imagine. I want you to uh, imagine. Okay? I just want you to guess what it would look like and then I want you to draw it. Okay, you everybody, me, show me. Uh, 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 Elsa, those lines. So we're not looking at that yet. Okay, Elsa, we're not looking at that yet. Okay. Down. Yeah. Uh, we'll, we'll draw one of those. We are only drawing from our imagination today, okay? This is Teacher, we only draw in this one. In the number one, picture number one. Number two and number three, okay? One, two, three. We draw, we draw three hammers. One. Two, we draw the three. three hammers. No, no colours. No colours, just a pencil. Okay. All right. I want to see everybody's hammer that they drew with their imagination. Mia, very good. Very good. Jack, very good. Let me see your hammers, everybody. I want to see your hammers. Good, Anna. Very nice. Good girl. Good Nijen, uh, Nat, Min, Suti, very good. Elsa, fantastic. Everybody say here, imagination. Does everybody know how to spell imagination? I'll write it in the chat for you. Imagination. All right, that's how you say imagination. Good, very good. So we got this is our imagination, the first one. Now, the second one. I want you, oops, I want everybody to take the picture of the hammer. Everybody look at this picture now. Have you got it? Now, I want you to hold this picture 
here in front of your face, in front of your face. But I don't want you to look at your paper. Do not look at your drawing. Just look at this picture. Okay, don't look at your picture. Look at me. I'm drawing here, but I'm not looking at this page. I'm only looking here. Okay. Teacher, I can't hear you. I can't hear you too. I always can see you. Can everybody hear me now? Can you hear me now? Yes. Yes, I can see yes. you. Yes. Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Okay, good. Now, look what I'm saying. I'm saying to you, I want everybody to look at this picture, but have it here in front of your face. You are not allowed to look at your picture as you're drawing. So you can't look at your page. You can only look at this picture. Are you ready? This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to try it. I want you to follow me. Okay, like this. It doesn't look fantastic, I know. It looks terrible. I don't even know what I'm drawing. Oh, my goodness. This is what I did without looking at my page. Isn't that silly? Isn't that silly? It's so silly. All right. So I'm going to write no looking at not looking at page. That's what I'm going to write here for the number, number two, the second one. Not looking at the page. All right? <laughs> it's like this. It's so silly, isn't it? It's very silly. It's a look. Okay, you ready? It's a look. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. That's terrible, but that's how I want it to be, okay? There's a reason why I'm doing this. Good, everybody did very well. Now, number three, number three, using this and looking at the page, okay? We are going to draw this hammer properly now. I want everybody to look at your picture and look at the page, okay? Go. I'm going to do it too, okay? I'm going to draw what I think is a better, okay?
Is everybody looking at this? Everybody should be looking at this and their page together. All right. What did you come up with, guys? Have you finished drawing? Let me see your work. Let me see what Let's you've done. Now, which one of these three pictures is the best one? What now? One, two, or three? Which picture is the best one? Three. Three? Have a look at yours. Yes, three. Yes, three. When we are drawing, do we use our imagination? When we are drawing something in reality, we don't use only our imagination. Are we always... Do we only look at the object and not the page? No, we look at the page and the object together, okay? So we are looking at the object and the page. That makes a better drawing, all right? Very good, very, very good, Mia. Good girl, much better, isn't it? Yeah, it's a much better drawing. Okay, very good, good job. Now. I want you to get another page like this. Everybody get another page, okay? Now, has everybody got a compass? Do you all have a compass? Do you remember we did our mandalas? Who remembers our mandalas that we made last time? Yeah, I yeah. have it. All right, I, good. Everybody grab your compass. And I want you to draw a nice big circle right in the middle. Now, my, my compass, I don't have it right now with me. It's in my car, left it in my car. Do we need to make it big like this? Okay, you need to make it around this size. I'll show you. Actually, I'll do it in texture just so that you can see it better. Okay, this is about the size I want it. I can't see it. Let me see if I can. Oh no, I've done it in text up. Don't do it in text, I want you to do it in pencil. Okay, that's about the size that I want it. Oh, my God, all these texts. Are not no. Okay, this is about the size I want it. Do it in text, though, only in pencil. Okay? All right. Now, I'm going to do mine in pencil again. Now, where you put your point, right, where you put your point in the middle, I want everybody to make some lines. Let me show you what we're going to do today. Can everybody see this? Can everybody see this? This is what we're going to create today. We are going to be working with all sorts of different lines, okay? But before we do that, sorry, I forgot that we need to, everybody needs to 
take out these, okay? These, these two handouts where there's types of line, types of line. Can you take these out? Do you have these photocopies? Types of line. What is that? This is a handout. Did, um, do you have it? Yes. You were supposed to take a photocopy of this. Do you have it, Tien? Um, what is a photocopy? Tien sushi. Tien sushi. Do you have this? Another small piece of paper. Well, it's two handouts. You need these for today's activity. Types of line. Yes, that's the one. Types of lines. All right. Now, put this aside for now. We're not going to work with this now. We're going to work with types of line. Can everybody grab a ruler and draw a straight line where it says straight? That's the first thing we're going to do, okay? I'm going to do mine in Texas so you can see better. All right, so straight line, one straight line. That's all I want you to do for now, okay? Now, the next one, what does it say? What does the next line say? Waved. 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 So what's a wavy line? There you go. That's a wavy line. Can everybody do that now? You don't have to do it in text. You can do it in pencil. I'm doing it in text so it can, you can see it better. Now, a dotted line. Now, a line that is dotted. So you can't just be dots anywhere. It has to be in a line, for example. Can see? Anybody see these dots? Can you see my little, my little dots? Good. Okay, so I want everybody to have a look at how I've created these dots now. See, in a line. Now, what's the next one say? Zigzag. Everybody knows what a zigzag is, right? Up, down, up, down, up, down, zigzag, all the way across. Keep going. What's the next one? Dashed. Do you know what a dashed line is? It's a line that is short, a lot of short lines. Dash, 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 dash. See that? Dashed lines. Okay. Scallop. Now, this scallop line is like used. You know the letter U? Like this. Yes. Or W's, if you want to say W's. Okay, now hash, hash is when the lines are together, many together, hashed. They can be straight or they can be sideways, but they have to be close together, okay? Hashed. Can everybody see what I'm doing here? Um, why is it this? Is that better? Can you see that better? It's very unusual that my phone is on the I can see it phone. better. It's better, yeah, I'm sorry. Okay, jigsaw. Now, jigsaw, has everybody seen a jigsaw puzzle? This is what it looks like. You know how the pieces, they have these bits that are coming out, these three bits? 
That's what a jigsaw puzzle is, a jigsaw line. We are working with line now. What needs to understand why we are doing this? We are looking at all different lines. Remember what line is? Line is one of the elements, the art elements. And we have other elements like value, all sorts of different things that we put into our recipe when we want to make art. Okay, the next one looped, okay, I'm going to do this. Can everybody see what I'm doing there? Looped. Say the word, everybody, looped. Looped. Loot. Yeah. Now the next one is lightning. Have you ever seen what lightning looks like? It's on the side, right? But on the sides. Lightning. Lightning. Did you guys watch the line video and the art elements video? Did everybody watch those two videos that I that I um that Duke sent you? Yes, I got a thumbs up. Yes, thanks, Mia. Good, Anna. Did you like those? Weren't they fun? I really like those videos. I really like watching them, especially the the art elements, that was so nice, such a nice video. All right, now thin, very, very thin, hardly touching, hardly pressing hard on your, on your pen or your pencil, very thin. And the next one is the opposite, it's thick. Yeah, I'm going to press really hard. In fact, I'll make it thick, I'll go back and forth just to make that a little bit thicker, a nice thick line. The first one is thin and then there's thick. Now this next one, slanted hash. Remember how I said hashed? So this one here, slanted hash, it's just going to be on the side. Slanted means on the side. Okay, so that's what we mean when we use slanted. All right, spiral is very much like the looped one, okay? Do you remember the looped one we did up here where it says looped? So the looped one, the loop is a little smaller. But the spiral is actually bigger. It's bigger loops, okay? It's much bigger loops. That's what a spiral is. Now, the next one is shark. Ooh, shark. Ready? Shark. Can you see that? That looks like the shark, the fin at the top. When a shark, has anyone seen a real shark? Probably not a real one. But if you've seen pictures, it's that fin that sticks out in the water when a shark. Is swimming in the water and it's swimming on the shallow part. Okay, now this next one, you ready to move on? Is everybody okay? Give me a thumbs up, everyone, if you are ready. Good. This next one is called walk around. So it's like walk and then we have to go around. Stop. It's like a half circle. Yeah, it's like a half circle. Next one, waves. Now the waves and the shark are very similar, but the one with the waves is a little bit curvier. For example, 
Look at this. Curvy. See? So it looks like the shark one, it's just a little bit curvier. See the difference? Can everybody see the difference between the shark and the waves? Yes? Yes. Good. I'm glad. Now, next one. Next page. Mouse ears. Now, the mouse ears are very much like the wolf crown and the jigsaw. So the mouse ears go like this. I can't see. Ah, sorry. It's very similar to the walk around and what was the other one? Jigsaw, okay? It's just the same. Now, swirl, a swirl is not a continuous line, but it's a line that just goes round and round and round itself, okay? Can everybody see swirls? Swirly, whirly, yes. whirly. So you start in the middle and then you get bigger and bigger and bigger, okay? Starting in the middle and going around and around and around until you can't go anymore, yeah? I love doing swirls. This is my favourite shape. This and love hearts. I love love hearts as well. Okay, now the cloud. You know what a cloud it's is, like, right? When it's like a lollipop. Yeah, it looks like a lollipop. You're so right. And the cloud is just like a fluffy cloud in the sky. It's easy, yeah? Easy. All right, now cross hatch. Do you remember how we talked about hatch here? Do you remember this hatch? Hatching, cross hatching. Hashed. Wait, 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 wait. Hash. No, no, cross hatching. So cross hatching is when you go one way and then you go another way, the opposite way. See that? So I'm going to go downwards. And what's the opposite of down? What's the opposite now? I've gone down. Now I want to do the opposite. It's going to be oh. sideways. See? See? It's going to go the opposite way. Cross hatching. Okay? Can you do that? I'm going to do it again here. So you get these lines all together. And now I'm going to go the opposite direction. That's what we call cross hatching. It's very similar to the hash. Now, circle chain, it's like a chain. Yeah, it means a chain. Basically, it's circles that are interlinked. Yeah, can you see how the circles, they're just joined together as if that they were a chain? Yeah. Yes. E now the heels, basically the heels is like what it says, up, down, up, down. So it's a bit like a wavy line, but the wavy is much flatter. Can everybody see the wavy line? Remember we did the wavy line? Now this one is a little bit different. It's steeper. Yeah, it's like a hill. All right. Now, curly, curly, curly is, basically curly is like spiral. Maybe, the, maybe they're touching each other. Maybe that's the difference, yeah, that they're all touching each other. Curly, whirly. It's like curly hair. Yeah, curly hair. Who's got curly hair? Nobody. I've I haven't got curly hair, but my sister has very curly hair. 
Scribbly. Okay. Now, when you're doing scribbles, you just have to scribble everywhere. You've got to do straight lines, curvy lines. Just scribble, scribble, scribble. You guys know how to do this. That's the, probably the first thing that you ever drew when you were younger. Scribbles. Horizontal, diagonal, and vertical. Di horizontal means lying down flat. These are horizontal lines. Diagonal means sideways lines, sideways. And vertical means straight lines. Okay, so these are different directions of a line. Okay. Who can think of any more lines that we haven't really done here? Who can think of some lines that we can write here and add? Who wants to try? Use your imagination. What else can we do? Come on, guys. Who can tell me some more lines that we haven't looked at? Anybody? I don't want to learn anymore. My hand is broken. Your hand is broken. <laughs> We're going to do the fun stuff now. Okay. Now, let's get back to this picture. This is what we're going to create now. Ready? We're going to create this. All right, this is what we're doing. So have a good look at what we're doing. I think everybody has a photocopy of this anyway, right? So the first thing we need to do is draw a circle in the middle of the page. Have we all got that? I want to bring this up a little bit just so that you can see it a little bit better. Teacher, my hand is broken now. Your head or your hand? Well... If you want to, maybe you can watch the video later, okay? If you're that tired, you can watch the video later. Now, are you all watching? Give me a thumbs up if you're all watching me. Can everybody see what I'm doing? Good. Now, we are going to draw some lines. Can everybody see these lines coming out of the circle? Okay, can everybody see these lines coming out of the middle? So there's the middle. Right, and now we are going to draw lines that are going to come out, right? And I need 14 of these lines, okay? I want you to count number 14 up to 14. So starting from the middle, squiggly lines going out, okay? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and one more, fourteen. Okay, I've got fourteen lines. Let me see everybody's work, please. I want to see what you've done. Gallery, everybody show me your work, please. Amazing. Good. Good, Jack. I can't see yours, Mina. Mina, I can't see yours. You've done it too light. I can't see. Come a little bit closer. I still can't see anything. Can you press a little bit harder? Let me see yours, Milk. 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 Yes. Now, some of your lines are a little bit close, though. Now, Ni Jen, uh, Nat Min, did you do yours with a texter? Did you do yours with a texter? Yeah, I did it. Did you do yours with a texter? You can't use a marker, you have to use your pencil. Alice, can I see your work, please? Good. Can That's you see Mina. me now? Mina, yeah, I can. Very good. Much better. Oh. 
Where's your center? Did you make your center in the middle of the circle? Did everybody start from the middle? Oh, yeah. From the middle. Okay, now, you listening? I want you to take a rubber, an eraser, and I want you to rub out every second one, okay? So here I'm going to rub out this one, and I'm going to leave this one, okay? So I'm going to rub out one, leave another. Rub out the next one, leave the next one. Rub out the next one, leave the next one. Rub out the next one, leave one, rub it out, leave it, rub it out, leave it, rub it out, leave it. Okay, so what I've got now, can everybody see what I've done? I've rubbed out part of my circle. Now I want you to take your text up. Who's got a black texter? Have you got a black texter? I want you to go over everything on this page. So I want you to go over the lines first. Yeah, uh, lines. I do much more. What book? Who's talking? Because there is uh, one, one, um, Yes. Did you draw your circle? By the way, did everybody well, draw this circle? Yeah, I only make uh, um, 12 waves. This is a circle. Elsa, where's your circle? You have to have a circle. Elsa, did yeah. you draw a circle? Yes, here. Yeah. But so but I am the, the, um, the. You have to make 14 lines, Elsa. Did you do 14 Peter, lines? I only got 12 lines. Yeah, you got to put 14 in there. 14. Okay. 14, but I got so many. And now 14. I need to 15 or 17. Have to put 14. You have to fit them in somewhere. Now, I only got 10 lines. Min, Min, did you draw your lines? No, no. Yes, that's good, Mia. Very good, Mia. I only got 10 lines. You've got to put another, got to put another four in. Cái đường này, đây là xóa đường này, chỗ này con đừng xóa, chỗ này rộng hơn. Đấy, cho nên là khi con học con đây, phải để ý. Cái này con xóa. Ok, where's, where's mom? Where's mom? Can con I only con got, got uh, cả, 10 lines, is it ok? No, it's got to be 14. Xóa con thêm vì khoảng cách này. Uh, so I con have to draw it again? No, you just, you just add rồi. some more lines somewhere where it's a little bit open. Oh. Just add about four more lines. Oh, now, Ni Jen, Jen, Nat, Min, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah. Have you, got, have you got your big lines? Have you got your big lines coming out like this? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I can't sorry. see them. I can't see them. All right, now, can everybody please rub out every second one, okay? And now, what I want you to do is I want you to go over everything in Texta, okay? Go over everything in Texta. Start with the lines. Can everybody see what I'm doing here? You've got to go over with your line. We will use a black pen. No, you use a texter, black texter. I only got this this one. 
Have you got a texter? Yeah. Good. So start drawing in whatever you've done in pencil. Now, wait till I finish this and I'll explain what you need to do. And now we will use a black uh, pen to draw it again. Yeah, well, you're going to go over it, aren't you? You're going to go over it. This and like this. Now, remember how you rubbed off all these ones? You have to put in the ones that you did not rub out, okay? Every second one, okay? Every second one. Okay, and this is what you have. Can everybody see what I've got now? Looks like a spider's web. So maybe you can rub off, you can rub off all the pencil markings, okay, just so that it's not messy. Just leave whatever is in texture. Okay, is everybody ready to move on? Has everybody got this on their page? Yes. I'm ready to move on. Good, that's good. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to work with my longer bits. Can everybody see these longer bits? Can we have five minutes right yeah. Do you want a little bit more time? Yes. Okay, I'll give you a little bit more time to catch up. Okay, so everybody should have a page like this in front of them. Can we have a break time, teacher? A break? <laughs> yes. Yeah, of course you can have a break. You can have a break, go to the toilet, go drink some water and come back. Okay, I'm going to do the same. I'm going to go get some water. Can I go to drink some water? Yeah, yeah, everybody go drink some water. Can I go and drink some water? Can I drink some water? Can I drink That's some it. water? Okay. Kéo tư đô mai là đi về với mẹ. Không, phải cắt đường. Tiếp thôi, chỉ mẹ nói đấy, kéo thế đi nó quần tay với con. I Okay, everyone, I'm back. Did you drink some water? 
Okay, yes, let's I now did. look at our lines. Everybody looking at our lines that we created here. Now, I know that you have this, but I don't want you to make it exactly the same, okay? I want you to make yours different. I've given you all these lines. We looked at all these lines that we did together. Yes, we looked at all these amazing lines. And that's what I want you to do. I want you to use some of these to create these. Now, notice where I have the darker lines. Can anybody see where I've got the darker lines? Where? Who can tell me where the darker lines are? Can you see where it's the darker so lines are? Yes. Everybody must know that in this circle part is where you make it darker than everything else. All right? So let's start with the first thing we need to do is start with these longer ones, okay? These long ones. I'm going to do dashed lines to start with, okay? I'm going to just do dashed. And now I'm going to go the other direction. I'm going to go in another direction soon. I'm going to change direction. These are my dashed lines. And now I'm going to go downwards. Can everybody see what I'm doing? You don't have to do it exactly the same as me. How's it all going, everybody? Are you making the lines? Not yet. I'm not finished. Yeah, I know. I'm not finished either. You can do yours in pencil first if you want to, or you can go straight with texture. Okay? No colour. You are not allowed to use colour in this. This is going to be just, just a line activity, okay? It's just a line activity. Ta-da! Finished mine. What do you think? Do you like mine? Let me see what you've done. Let me see your work, everybody. Can you hold up your work? I want to see. Mine is so... I think they... Very nice. Very good. Okay, we're going to do another one now. You ready? Now this one. Let's do this one. Ready? I'm going to do this one. I'm going to make this. Okay. Watch my squiggly line. Squiggly, 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 squiggly. Can you everybody see what I've just done there? Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to repeat this squiggly line. I'm going to repeat it on both sides. All right? Again. Squiggly. Again, and on this side as well. Okay, I'm going to keep on going. Actually, you know what I'm going to do here? 
I'm going to, yeah, no, that's enough. I don't want to do any more there. I'm going to do another long one. I'm going to do my long one first, my long ones first. I like this one. Okay. Nobody has to do it exactly like me. In fact, I prefer it if everybody does something original. It's good that you do your own. I don't want everybody's to look like mine. I want them to look like yours. You I want you to put your creative twist on it. Now. I'm going to use some of these lines that we made here today. I'm going to do the scallop one, like this one. They look like... Um, fish scales, don't they? These look like fish scales. Now, who can tell me, I want you to unmute yourself, who can tell me why we're doing these activities today? What are we looking at? What are we looking at and we're doing these activities today? Who can tell me? Can anybody tell me why we're doing this activity? No? Are we working with line today? Line. We did a drawing with line. We looked at all the art elements, but this particular activity is only about line. Are we going to use colour in this? No, no colour. Just pen or pencil or texture. Okay. Right. Now, we only have about half an hour left of this lesson. Right. And if you're not going to finish it today, I want you to finish it when you go home, okay? When you go home, when you are home. It's so busy. I can ever do that. Look. Where? Who's talking to me? Let me have a look. Who's talking? I just who's talking? You. Where are you? Oh, Elsa. Is that you, Elsa? Yes. What's wrong? Tell me. I never do like that. Many, many that. I just yeah. do. Yeah. That's okay. That's okay. Keep going. It's beautiful. It's going to look amazing when you finish. Keep going. Look up mine. Show me. Wait, who's talking? Me Mina. See. Let me see. Mina, that looks amazing. Good girl. You're really keeping up with me, aren't you? Mina, you're keeping up with me. I love that. Yeah. Can you think of something like to do you. with you? 
what's some other ideas that you have? What are some other things um, you can think of? I like, I like this one where it's the flowers. So I do lines like this, right? Right? And then I draw little flowers or little, do little dots. And just little round circles like beads, you know, beads. You can do anything really. Just use your imagination. So I am finished. Show me. Who's, who said that they were finished? How can we be finished? We just started the activity. Oh, Elsa, you finished one. Okay. All right. So I, want, I don't want to do more. Okay. That's okay. That's okay by me. You can do them another day. When you're bored, you can do some more. But you have to look at these beautiful, these beautiful so that they can help you. Okay. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to ask that you start on the middle part, okay? I'm going to ask. For the circle area, the middle part having to be a little bit darker than the rest. Okay, see this picture? Right? Uh, Beautiful. It's not very clear, is it? Everybody see that picture there? So let's do some, uh, what am I going to do now in here? I'm going to draw circles and ovals, okay? Circles and ovals everywhere. And and then I'm going to colour in the outside. Like little stones. And then I'm going to colour around it so it can be dark. Okay. You don't have to do this. You can make your own patterns. But I want the inside of these circles. Teacher, please, can I say something? I cannot see. Can you? Yeah, Vicky, your internet your words are black. I can't see. You said yes. that. Yeah. It's not clearly. Yeah. Your screen, your screen is not clearly. Oh, it's frozen. Your internet has the worst lag. They said that uh, uh, your network my internet, my internet has lag. 
It's not clear. Okay. Can you talk, can you see me in this video, in the video here, what I'm doing? Can you see me here? Yes, I can see. Yeah. So I'll hold it up like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is what I'm doing now. Teacher, like this. Wow, that's amazing, Mina. You're so quick. You're much quicker than I am. You're so fast. It's amazing. Okay, what well, this is another idea that I have. Okay, watch. Yes. I don't I don't draw like you. Uh this one next to me. All right, and I'm going to go this way. I'm going to it's do like every, kale. every other one, okay? So I'm going to do like a chessboard. You know what chessboards are? Right? Yes. Like a chessboard, yeah. Yes, like that. I know how to play chess. Do now, that's great. I think very smart people play how to, know how to play chess. I know how to play chess, but I don't play it very often. But I think a lot of smart people play chess. What are, what are some other things that smart people do? What are some I'm really good at play chess too. What are some other things that smart people do? Do they read books? Yeah. Did everybody freeze on me again? I'm no. I'm really sorry. Can you listen to me? Can everybody see what I'm doing here? Great. Can you listen to me? I'm I'm going to do um, some spirals now. Some spirals. What else do I want to do? Actually, I want to do some zigzags. I'm finding Show me your work, everybody. I want to see what you've been doing. Show me your work. Sushi, that's good. Good girl. Keep going. I like it. That's very nice, Jack. Jack and Lily. Very good. Can you see mine, teacher? Mina, that's amazing. Mina, you're so quick. My goodness. Alice, that's amazing. I finished. Let me see, Suti. Where are you? I can't see it. I can't see it. Are you doing yours in pencil? Suti? Why are you doing it? Why are you doing it in texture? I want you to do it in texture. 
You don't know that. You don't have a text up? No. What about you, book? Let me see yours, book. Wow. Very nice. Now, you guys are not going to finish this today. You aren't. I know. It's a long, it's a big project. But when you do, I want you to upload it onto, um, what's that? What's it called again? The chat. Oh, Zello. 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 That's it. Thank you. So I'm feeling the TikTok. Um, I need you to put, um, okay, I'm going to ask you, do you have your English names there as well? Do you have your English yes. names there so I can pronounce it? Yes. Suti, is that your English name? Lily. Lily, my name is Lily. My English name is Lily. Lily, you have to write that down so I can see it, right? Where your name is on your screen. Everybody Lily. needs to put their names on their screen so that I can see their names and I can call you and I want to talk to you. Yes. Wait a minute, Min. What did you say, Min? My name is Yatman, and my English name is Sam. I can't hear you. Have to speak a little bit closer to the microphone. I can't hear you. Yes. Are you going to write something in the chat? What? My, my English name is Sun. All right, Sun, I want you to write that down in your, nick, in your name. When you get onto the Zoom, there's a way you can do that. I don't know how it is, but I want everybody to write their English names in there so I can see, like Elsa and Mai. Mai, do you have an English name? Mai, Un? Do you have an English name? Yes. How do you say your English name? My name is Mai. Mai, is that your English name? Yes. What is it? Change it. I can't hear you, Mai. What's your English name? But I am here. Is your mum there? Maybe she can tell me what your English name is. Mm -hmm. I don't have English name. Well, you have to find one. You can. I gave myself a, a, my name Vicky. I gave my name Vicky because my teachers couldn't say my Greek name. Okay, she uh, she uh, she doesn't have English names yet. Oh, she, she doesn't have her name yet. Yes, yes. She so, have say that have English name. Yes. She doesn't have an English name? Yes. Okay, so her name is May An. Is that right? May An? Yes, her name is May An. May An. And that's your Vietnamese name? Yes. Yes, that's right. Okay, do you have any idea what you want to call her for an English name? Uh, yes, I will ask, and I recommend. I will ask her later. I will ask her later. Or uh, have you uh, have any recommend for me? Of Can I recommend my aunt is May or May. Anne? Yeah. Or Anne. My. Anne is like, you know, Anne. Anne. Yeah. Anne. Oh, yes. Dorothy, right. can okay. you please? I, I, I will ask her later. Uh, I will ask my Anne. I'll uh, answer later. Yes. Yeah. yeah, Anne, May, or May Anne, or even May Anne. That's a nice name. Um, Thank you. Dorothy, yes. can you please... 
tell everybody to put their English names in so I can call them by their names. It's a bit hard for me to pronounce the um yeah okay sometimes not always. Uh, for example, I couldn't say yeah. There they, you go, son. Yeah, son. That's all good. right. So you they have to put their English or nickname and then CT nickname age and CT right. That's, that yes. should be in yes. your um in your Zoom as well as in your drawing, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Right. So I think one is good. Alice here, right? So Alice, Alice, um, maybe just put 11 instead of put uh to right? So just Alice, Hanoi, and 11, right? So the way we put is Alice, 11, HN, right? All right, and then you can put Mary, right? So, for example, Alice is good, right? And everyone else, you do the yes. same, yeah? Happy is good, yeah? Lily is good, right? So, everyone, can you take the tie? Me is good, yeah? So, me, yeah. Maybe you don't need the comma, just put nickname. So, for the me, 11 Hanoi. Right, that's that's good enough, right? So let me yeah, see. So it's, yeah. So it's your, right, nickname, yeah. your English name, the age, and then your Vietnamese name. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, David Trail Hanoi. That's good. Yeah. So we don't need the comma. Yeah. All right. Uh, or you put in the chart. Right. So Lily is good. Now maybe I rename for Lily. The reason we put Hanoi is the last. Because the city is last, because you know we we can have everyone in the same um what we call is the same same city is in it together, right? Yeah, that's we apparent, right? So me is good, Mila, yeah. Okay, all right. So everyone, please right. rename yourself if possible. And then, so Vicky, now familiar with your name? Yeah. Um, you want me to remind? Yeah, you want you to remind Hi them a few things? To high end to do it as well. Hi, 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 yen, hi, yen, hi, ji, yen. Thing is good. All right, yes. Now, wing, wing. Uh, Ping Wing, please, Good. please, Chen, because it's very hard to pronounce. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah, I, 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 I told up. All right. Mina is good. Yeah. Jack and Lily is good. Okay. Okay. You yeah. know what I want to do? I want to know if everybody's going to answer to their names. I'm going to call your name, and I want you to wave to me, but only you, only whose name I call. Okay. So. Sun. Sun. Yeah. Yeah, good. Just give me a wave, okay? Just give me a wave. Natalia. Natalia. She's not listening. Natalia's not answering to her name. Mina. Mina. Yes. Yeah, good girl. Give me a wave. Okay. I want you, I want to know, I want to hear your I want to say your names and I want you to just give me a wave so I know that you're responding to your name. Sushi. Sushi. Good girl. Good girl. See, she's waving at me. Book. 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 You gotta wave at me, okay? James. James, give me a wave. Yes. You have to wave at me. Yeah, just wave at me. Milk. Milk. Good girl. Lily. Lily, good girl. Elsa. Elsa. Yes. Yes. You're not listening to me, though. You should be waving at me, okay? Anna. Where's Anna? Good girl, Anna. David, give me a wave, please. 
Thank you. Sapphire. Sapphire, give me a wave, good girl. Mina, did you wave at me yet? I can't remember if I called your name. Good girl. Mia. Mia. Good. Anna. Where's Anna? Is she there? Good girl, Anna. You call me the second wave. time. Sorry. Uh, Jack, Jack and Lily. Lily. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Okay, who's named and high end? I didn't see, I didn't call out high end's name. Okay, good. Now, what I want you to do is I want everybody to, oops, hang on. How do I, oh, there it is. I want everybody to, um, I want everybody to hold up their artwork, please. I want to see your artwork. That's amazing, Mia. Jack and Lily. Lily, that's amazing. Keep going. Yes. Remember what we said about the circle. The circle has to be darker than everything else. Good, son. Good, Natalia. Good, Milk. Fantastic, Sapphire. Really good stuff, you guys. Anna, fantastic. Mina, fantastic. Dita, I am really welcome, my um, and I now I cannot draw finish. It's okay. You don't have to finish it today. You can finish it in the next week yeah. till next time. But when okay. you do finish, okay. I want you to post it so that I can see it. Sushi, that's great. Keep going. Keep going. I want you to use my example. This is my example. Or we can use these that we did today in our in our activity for the lines. Okay. Next week, everybody is going to start painting. Okay. We're going to start painting next week. I'll show you what we're doing next week. Oh, a pencil neck break that. I love the fire. Teacher? Teacher? Yes. Can I uh, make it different from you? I finished today. Sorry, Lee, I didn't understand. Can you say that again? Can I finish it today? But I want to go different. And I want it to finish today. Yeah, if you want to finish today, you finish today, absolutely. So yeah, next week, we're going to be name? doing some painting. What did you say? Tita, what's your yes. name? My name is Vicky. What's your name? My what's name your, is Anna. What's your English name? You must write your English name. Please write your English name. Sure. Mm -hmm. My name is sure. Yeah. Dorothy, did you understand what he said for an English name? Sorry, I couldn't hear. Teacher. Who's that? It's high uh, end. High end. High end, huh? Who, who? Can you raise your hand, please? Ok, Huyền hả? Huyền Nguyễn hả? Em tên gì? Con tên gì? Con tên là Hà Phương chị ạ. Em, em bây giờ em đặt một cái tên gì đó, một tên tiếng Việt không giấu hoặc là một tên tiếng Anh. À. Chứ em để Huyền Nguyễn thì em để nguyên tên của con là cũng không 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 gọi à, đâu okay, nhé. Để một cái tên gì đó, su, sa, sim gì đó, để cái tiếng Việt không giấu. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Okay, right. so next yeah. week, next week we will be painting a color wheel. So you need color wheel. You need your paints with you, okay? And we will be doing some. You, uh, Dorothy, you're going to send them a video as well. Yeah, they have uh, to watch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I send them the video. Yeah. yeah. A video and I think there's one handout, a handout. We're going to be creating
we're going to be creating this and we're going to be working with tone and shade doing some activities with color okay but i really want to see these pictures today i want to see what you do with them okay make sure that you post them and put your name on it and your age So you want me to show the picket? You still here? You want me to give them the painting, the color, yeah? Just one so, or how many? Well, did did you only get see the one? Email? Did you get the email that I sent you? Yeah, only one. The week two color pen, landscape in opposite color. How yes. many you give me? Yeah, two only each. One. Yeah, they need to take photos of that twice because they're going to do what one with analog analogous oh, colors. Oh, I got you. One, yeah, and one with uh, opposite colors. So we need to do two of you. those landscapes, two photocopies each. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And we're going to do the color wheel. Okay. We're going to need their compass. Yeah, and we're going to draw up a table where we're going to do tints, shades, and tones. We'll draw up the table. I don't want them to do it on paper because it won't absorb all the um, those paint. colors. All right, everybody. I think you've all done such an amazing job today. I'm very I much forward. Good, they're very nice, Sushi. Good colors, nice, perfect. We're going to use those next week. Now, has everybody got paint brushes? Yes. Have you got, yes. a, jar? Have you got yes. a jar so that you can wash it out? And I need a cloth. You need a cloth, like a tissue. We need some tissue. Tissue. Right? So that you can wipe. Teacher. Yes. Who's talking? I have them. Good. Everybody. Yeah. Can Everybody. I uh, go out now because my, my battery is low? Yeah. Okay. All right. You can go. Bye, everybody. You can all Bye. go. See you later. Bye. See you next week. Bye. Nice Goodbye, teacher. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye, teacher. Bye. Goodbye, teacher. Bye. Goodbye. Bye, teacher. 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 Bye,